All right, guys, this is Identity Crisis. We're gonna redo this mission, and uh, I think we're almost. I think we're at the end of the game, to be honest. I'm not sure, but I think we're pretty close to the end. You gotta admit, I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation weren't working. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's program is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years, fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training's complete. You just need to give the subject a name. Bell. Vanderhoof! That's my actual soldier's name, is Cletus Vanderhoof. So, not Bell, it's Vanderhoof. I don't know what's next. I know yesterday we did that mission where we had to kill all the Adlers. Ad Adlers. I can't speak. Adlers. There we go. And uh, it was like, like a dream scenario or something. Damn, can you load already, game? I mean, it would be nice. About time. It's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Percy say? Where is he? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start cooperating. Where is Perseus? You tell us, Bell. That's what this whole fucking thing is about. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Oh, that makes sense. So I was the guy in the back seat, okay. When the plane leaves traps on his stopping in Doom. This, you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we'll remove the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. Solovetsky, that's where it is. But I have other plans. Perseus thinks too highly of me. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. So now they're being truthful, at least. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond. 
to establish trust. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, got come on, we got a job to do. So he's been... I've been there the whole time with him, and I didn't even realize... Trigger phrase kept you in line. You didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind the door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. Duh. Done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you. It's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who in the end has no true allegiance to anyone other than itself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Solovetsky. Once we control the Green Lab, also, we will detonate them all for the safety of Solovetsky. This is your chance to find out. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. It's as simple as that. You tell the truth, you get off the table. Is he wearing Tommy Hilfiger's shirt? That thing was. Can I, can I, okay, I was gonna say, can I walk or not? Or nah. Perseus, the CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task, protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us will cross the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. I've, that ends now. I think this is the last mission of the game, guys. Boys and girls, ladies and gents. Cats and dogs, liz lizards and reptiles. Solovetsky Islands, USSR, March 15th, 
All right, let's go. Dang, I tried to rush it and I didn't work out. Be advised, 
We are scorching Earth. Clear all friendlies. Repeat. Clear all we gotta friendlies. go now. Oh my god, I'm dead. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. We stopped him. Those towers are history. What's the situation down there? Come in. Woods, have you found them yet? Over here! Give me a hand! Take my hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Dang, okay. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah. With both he and Arash Kadovar dead, their terrorist network collapsed as surviving members fought for control. With no clear leadership in place, it appears the Soviets have decided to cut ties and clean up the mess. Approximately 72 hours ago, the militant's primary encampment was burned to the ground. Nothing but ashes. Apparently, the few survivors that escaped have scattered and gone into hiding. What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azale's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovesky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance. Which, of course, we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? Not only did we stop a nuclear attack, we managed to take out Major Vadim Rudnik. That should be a significant blow to Perseus's European network. We also flushed one of Rudnik's key assets down the shitter. There's a couple left, and eventually they'll hit the sewer, too. Well, you're a wordsmith, that's it. And Bell. This is the end, boys. There's the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me. Is this where I'm gonna die? It was always for the greater good. It's like a spot where it's like your last, like, you're a hero, you're a where I'm about to die or something. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal.
Did I just die? I think so. Wow, it's over. Okay, guys. We could add that to the list of games beaten. Let's go. Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. This was a good story mode. Didn't understand the whole dream scenario with a bunch of Adlers. But they explained it to you. Like, they were putting his memories into you. So, thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button and subscribe. Also, hit that bell notification so you guys know when I go live. I try to go live for you guys every day. Let's get to 200 subs so I can get taste for you guys on camera. Thank you for watching. Peace.